What up YouTube? Hey, it's Anime Hound. Um, I know I haven't done a video in a while. Uh, I'm stuck doing various things. Um, just, it, it's been rather hectic lately with me, uh, with plans. Uh, my friends invited me to go with them to Nats in uh, Minnesota. But all that aside, um, <clears throat> I've got some Modern Warfare videos that are going to be coming out once I can figure out why they keep skipping. They seem to record properly, but when you view them back, they skip. I might just put them up anyway because, honestly, I can narrate through the, the skip parts. But that's neither here nor there. Um, I've got two deck profiles uh, in two separate videos. Uh, one's going to be for the gadgets I've been running, and the other one is going to be because a friend of mine's birthday is coming up. And he's a very special friend of mine. I'm going to... I made him a Blackwing deck. And I'm going to show that off too. To show that I, you know, I'm not one-track minded when it comes to certain types of decks. So, this is what we're going for. It's my gadget deck. Uh, a lot of inspiration came from M. Cole 40 because he's a leading uh, gadget authority, I'll say. So, uh, much, much props to him. Uh, he's helping me out with this because I'm missing one Hobby League yellow gadget and I want it. So, he's getting me one. Um, and I'm going to have another deck uh, profile of uh, my friend Paul, who's been running a nice Synchron deck. And I will be putting up my Golden Homunculus deck, too, once I finish messing with it. It's a really fun deck, uh, based on Remove from Game. Golden Homunculus can get really big in it. So, there we go. With, uh, using my tripod, yay. Uh, here we go. We start off. Two Cyber Dragon. Two red gadget, two yellow gadget, two green gadget. Now this used to be Machina, uh, Machina, and I just got tired of it. Spirit Reaper, one Morphing Jar, three Doom Caliber Knight, one Gale, one Tragodia, and one Gores, and one Drillroid. This is my little add-in. Uh, a lot of people don't see it coming. Uh, it takes care of a lot of those set cards that um, you just don't want out. Um, Help me get over uh, a Machina Fortress today. Uh, I booked it, summoned him, got over it. It was awesome. Uh, that's it for the monsters. Um, I will say a lot of people yell, uh, you know, tell me I shouldn't play the two Cyber Dragons in here, but honestly it's to bait out the bottomless and if they don't, I make them attack over it before I do anything else. So he's a big help. Um, Spirit Reaper is just awesome in general. Uh, a lot of the times, you know, they they try to get over it and they can't. Uh, morphing jars for the dead hands or the gadget hands. Oh God, am I plagued by those lately? Uh, three Doom Caliber Knights. Um, this is just effect hate, uh, monster hate. Uh, 1900 attack, 1800 defense. He's just freaking awesome. Um, he helps win games big time. Uh, Gale, mostly for his having effect and uh, tuning. Uh, I actually had to use him once to Black Rose the field because I didn't like what they had set up, and uh, it paid off. Uh, Trigon Gores, because Tragodia can become really big in this deck uh, with all the plussing you're going to be doing. <clears throat> Since this is a pretty uh, laid-back deck, uh, knowing when to take attacks or not, Trigon can be in huge help because he's, he also wins games. Um, helped me win against Black Wings two weeks ago. Uh, played this today at Locals, uh, got third. Um, we split the top four because uh, there was another tournament that was going to be starting for Magic, so we just rushed it. So uh, I placed third statistically uh, at four, uh, uh, three and one, so I'm happy. And I already explained to Roy. Now we'll go to Spells. Two Book of Moon. Uh, three was a little bit too much. I was originally running three in my uh, Machina build, and I just didn't like it. Uh, it was coming up, and I really... It's not that aggressive, so I'm not going to worry about it that much. I dropped it down to two, made it uh, made a little more room for things that were necessary. Uh, three Smashing Ground. And two Fissure. Like, amazing feel, uh, field control here. Uh, I always have at least one of them in hand. Uh, save them for bigger monsters or if I'm going to make any kind of real big push. Really pressures the opponent. Lightning Vortex. Uh, a lot of people scream at me f for using this too because of Starlight Road. But um, honestly, you'll know how to get around it and when and when not to use it. So uh, it, it's 
it, I, I've yet to get hit with Starlight Road using that. One pot of Avarice because draw power is needed. Uh, you go through your gadgets fast enough that you really need it. You got MST and Heavy Storm for back row hate. Uh, it's, it's pretty much just staples. 3D Prisons. More monster hate. Two Royal Oppression, because it works against basically er everything in the format. Uh, really wrecks uh, Infernities. Slows down X Sabers. Two Bottomless, more monster removal. Uh, then we got Mirror Force and Torrential, and more monster hate. Staples, Solemn Judgment, pretty much a staple. Trap Dust Shoot. Uh, this card is just too freaking awesome opening play see what they you know see what they got in their hand and it just wrecks things up for them and one starlight road uh, I was having a conversation with my friend Paul today about how he believes this card should be banned because it has changed an entire format and in a way it has just for the fact that it negates the mass destruction and you don't even have to bring out the stardust if you don't have it but the simple fact remains is that you're still able to control what your opponent is doing with just one card uh... lightning vortex gets stopped heavy gets stopped torrential gets stopped mirror force gets stopped uh... uh... what else um, uh, oh what was it um... for the black wings uh... Bleh, their trap card i can't remember the icarus attack thank you uh... It, it, it just it just helps out so much and knowing when to set this bluffing your opponent if, they, if they've seen it in game one they know you have it they're going to be a little more hesitant to use what they're going to use any of their uh, their mass destruction cards uh, it also helps it stops against helps against glads because it forces them to play not so aggressive with their guys Aris. now we'll move on to the extra deck uh, it's pretty standard uh, two stardust Brian Ack, Cataster, Black Rose, Mistworm this is a little different, uh, Flameville Uruquas. Uh, I've actually gotten to use him. He's actually pretty awesome. Uh, piercing damage. Uh, and each time he gets a successful attack through, he gains uh, 300 attack. Uh, I got him up to 28 at one point. It was awesome. Uh, one Goyo. One Red Dragon. One Hundred Eyes Dragon. One Gyanite, the Force of Earth. The Hundred Eyes is just in there to take up space. One Colossal. One Magical Android and to Chimera Tech Fortress. Now uh, this one, this is going to be a little interesting. We've got two Fossil Dinos. Um, I haven't had a chance to test them out yet. I got him today, but uh, M. Cole 40 um, brings these up a lot and several so have other real big gadget users uh, and I don't mind it. Uh, it looks like it works really, really well, especially with the format is with Special Summoning. So I'm going to give these a try. Uh, two Thunder King. Uh, just really works well in the mirror match uh, against Machina because they can't add cards to their hand other than drawing. Now this is my little interesting little tech. Uh, it's supposed to be two Gemini Imp for the X Saber matchup. Um, when this card, when a card effect controlled by your opponent is activated, that would make you discard from your hand. Gotems. Uh, by sending this card from your hand to the graveyard, negate the activation and the effect of that card and destroy it. So that's a huge help and gets rid of a 3100 attack monster. Uh, two Raikou, I might drop one out for something else, I'm not sure yet, but this is awesome in the uh, in, in those odd matchups where you just aren't, you, you need that extra monster removal. Two Noblemen for the uh, matchup against Quick Draw. Uh, a lot of setting that's going on. Dust Tornado for a little bit of extra back row hate. Two crevices to the different dimension, this like makes Infernity players cry like something bad. Uh, black wings as well, and gadgets because of machines, and two pulling the rugs for the mirror match and against monarchs. So this is it. Let me know what you think. And sorry about that. Uh, apparently this thing only has a set time span of how long it can go. Uh, let me know what you guys think. Down, you know, let me know down here. Thumb me up. Do whatever. Uh, rate, sub, do whatever. And uh, this is Anime Hound out.